I came in not really knowing what to expect my first Olympic qualifying season. I wasn't old enough the last time around and I was just really excited to make the team. I'm kind of still in shock with everything that's happened and I'm just so happy to be here with this amazing group of people. Yeah, coming from an individual sport, it's really cool to feel like you're a part of something that's bigger and be supporting uh, everybody here and everyone having support for you and it's great to be out here. It's an honor again to be up here on the worldwide stage representing free ski uh, this time around coming in as an Olympic silver medalist and now going for both half pipe and slope style has been a goal of mine going into Sochi and I didn't achieve that but now I have so I'm excited to represent myself, my friends, my family and my country in, in two events and be the first one to do it so I'm, I'm thrilled and uh, hopefully I can bring home another medal. Nick, Maggie, Devin, and I are all here for our second games, and I think we can all agree that it's very difficult to get here. One Olympics alone is, is hard, and to be at the top of your game four years later is very difficult, so I have a ton of respect for all the athletes that are competing in their fourth and fifth games. It's just unbelievable to me. Um, but yeah, it feels good. I, I feel like I've got a little bit more pressure and a little bit more expectation this time around, but also a ton of support and I'm just really, really happy to be here with uh, all these guys and part of Team USA. Four years ago I made the team, uh, the Olympic team in Sochi when I was 15 years old and unfortunately on the third day of training I fractured my fibula right above my ankle and I was not able to compete, which was, you know, one of the most heartbreaking moments of my career and I told myself that day four years ago that I was going to do whatever it took to make it back and be sitting here with this amazing, incredible team. I am just so, so honored and, you know, I'm just ready to, you know, represent Team USA and show the world what we do. The rails look really, really cool. Um, ton of different options. So I think creativity is going to play a big part in um, this competition just because of how the setup is. And I think it's going to be a ton of fun because of that. To make it to the X Games, get an X Games medal was at the top of that list. And um, just standing on the podium every time is a huge honor. So I'm just, you know, thrilled with the success that I've had. And, um, you know, at this point, um, the next step is kind of the Olympics for me. So uh, to cap off what already is such an amazing career for me with, with an Olympic medal would be huge. But at the same time, it's already a win for me. I'm just kind of trying to enjoy this, this journey and this experience. And, uh, yeah, everything's kind of the cherry on top at this point. So, uh, yeah, I'm loving it. I had a bronze medal in Sochi, and so um, I'd be lying if I said I didn't have a little chip on my shoulder and, and want to better that this time around. And being the only Winter Olympic medalist from Indiana representing the Midwest, I'd like to bring another medal back home to the Hoosiers.